So who, who, who are the top five artists you're listening to? This can be in random order. Just <laughs> the artists you're listening to at the moment now. I'm listening to General Ozzy. <laughs> to General Ozzy all the way, top five. I'm listening to General Ozzy all the way because I've got a lot of songs that we're still working on and perfecting. So most of the time, I jump in the car, I'm, I'm trying to figure out, like, okay, how best can we make this record sound better? Because once it's released, that's it, you know what I mean? You can't get it back, you can't pull it back. Yeah. It goes and that's it. So in the quest of giving the public good music, great music, music that will resonate with you and will last decades and decades and decades. Yeah. I'm listening to General Ozzy. So, th so there is no top five <laughs> at the moment? Nah, it's just General Ozzy top five. Wow, <laughs> ah, I love that, okay. Uh, but uh, before I actually conclude, I'd, I'd love to find out this from you. Uh, yeah. It's a conversation that came up recently. I know that when you were coming up, radio was such a big thing, you know, mm. uh, being on the countdowns, just getting airplay was, was such a, a big thing. Yes. But today, and I, and I saw KB posting something about this the other day, I had my own reservations about it. Mm -hmm. He was talking about, you know, telling artists not to, uh, I, and now I might misquote him here, but my understanding of that was people should not be as excited about being on radio countdowns and should focus more on, on streams and all these things because there's money, according to him. Mm -hmm. What are your thoughts on that? Uh, you know, radio. And, and, and radio. by the way, and I ask you also yeah. because you've been on radio. I I've think been it on radio. Be. You've yes. both been on radio anyway. Yeah. If I'm not mistaken, you worked at the same place, even. <laughs> <laughs> I'll ask you one question. I'll ask you probably two, three questions, yeah? Mm. Yeah, just to help us. Uh, when an artist releases music, there's different mediums now mm. where you can actually upload that music. But mostly, I think, where would you hear the record first time? I mean, with the, the advent of social media, I mean, it's, 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 it, it depends. I, I've got a bias because I'm, I'm era, on radio, so I'll probably have era, a bias. The era that. I'm coming from, yeah. I'll be very honest with you, and everybody out there knows, yeah. is radio. Yes. You know, you listen to the radio, and that's why you've heard people singing songs about artists singing about Mr. DJ play me that song mm -hmm. and whatever you know because radio is what you'll find in every home right now that's why you have it on a phone even one of the cheapest phones you'll find a radio mm -hmm. why there's power in the radio you know you give a DJ he's got power with a new record you know he'll if he loves it with a passion he'll play it you know mm -hmm. and what will happen People listen. When they listen, well, they want to listen to it. The other, you know, like just after you, you're done with it. Mm -hmm. So what do they do? Mm -hmm. Where will they go? Mm -hmm. They'll try and get it. Yeah. Because Chimweka I just played it, and now he's playing a different record. Yeah. And they don't want to listen to the record you're playing now, because yeah. they want to listen to the, that previous record. What yeah. will they do? They'll purchase that record. Mm -hmm. So you can't play down radio, the power of radio. You know, I mean, radio is huge, man. Yeah. Radio is huge. Radio pays. I, my music get. I get paid every time my record gets played. Oh yes. You know what I'm saying. You've obviously figured out too many ties, the Zan Corps and yeah, all these things. Yeah. That's what it is. Royalties and all you that. You know, so <laughs> yeah. I'll get paid on radio, and I'll get paid at that particular stream that you're talking about. Yeah. You know, but radio is like really, really important, man. It's like without radio, hey, come on. And I guess it also shows um, where you where you're at as artists because. I mean, some artists yeah, haven't, it does. haven't figured it does. out. It does. I'm, I'm coming from an era where um, Radio Phoenix used to have a countdown, mm. okay, called the Local Rhythms Countdown. Which is it still was, there. Yeah, w which was being sponsored by, I think it's Airtel yep. and yep. Zane back in the day, mm -hmm. you know. And that was like the biggest platform for artists. Mm -hmm. They used to have that countdown. And those Song of the Year, you know, and the follow-up song, you know, it made artists big. It made it big did. artists. Yeah. It did. It did. You know, and I want that. Mm. You know what I mean? I I want that with my song Nimusanga. Mm. I want that with Chimtengo Chamango, with Potential. Mm -hmm. You know, mm -hmm. and that was from a countdown. Yeah. You know, so uh, I wouldn't really downplay these radio stations. They're actually doing a great job. 
Um, I mean, everybody's entitled to an opinion. That's yeah. my opinion. Yeah. I feel like those are important. People actually keeps people in track with what where they're at. It's like a litmus, you know, to see exactly where you're at. Like, oh, okay, mm -hmm. fine, mm -hmm. so cool. Right. I mean, some believe in them, some don't. don't. You know what I mean? So, hey, some of us do. Yeah. We need to give KB a call and just talk. We want to talk, <laughs> KB? We want to talk. To watch longer interviews such as this, subscribe to our YouTube channel, Diamond TV Zambia.